all and welcome to my channel. My name is Jersey. Today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial how I plant tomatoes in a water trough and I use eggshells for calcium in the soil and how to deter cutworms and slugs around the tomato plants using eggshells and I have a full blog on how you can use it inside your home for your pets and much much more. I will leave that link below. Let's get started. Put a piece of cattle fencing in to hold the three tomato plants up. Now we are putting our crushed, washed, and dehydrated organic eggshells. And I will do a very thin layer of dirt just to cover the shells. I cut roughly two thirds of the tomato stems. And I will plant it up to here and all this will be in the dirt. And these are suckers. I come out side every few days, clean hands, and I pinch these suckers off. Now here's another one. I do not let these suckers grow. Others might, but this takes the energy. I want the, all the energy to go into the fruit. And if it's growing more suckers and branches, it's gonna take its energy away. And these tomato clippings will go in the compost bin. Some strawberries, some marigolds, two romas, and a cherry tomato. Top dressed it with good compost dirt, put a layer of mulch, and now I'm going to feed it with my manure tea that we made the other day, and I will leave the link to that video below. I thoroughly get this wet, and then I'm gonna feed it some watered down manure tea to get it started. Ray's gonna add some manure tea, but not touching the plant. In a few days, I will come out and I will start tying up the tomatoes to the back of the fence. And I added my butterfly feeder of water. Plenty of rocks, fresh, clean water. Since I come out here every night, I'll be watering this and I'll change the water. I like to put it underneath plants so it keeps the water cool during the day. As the tomato grow, I'll move the dish back. And let's not forget to put a generous amount of coarse eggshells around the base of each plant. This will deter slugs and cutworms. And this is DE, it's organic. This is what I sprinkle in my indoor birds, my sun conure and my African gray in their food. I'm gonna put a sprinkle of this around each base of the plant. After it rains or, or after I water it, I have to reapply an application of this DE. And that trough is done. If you have made it this far, thank you. I really appreciate that. Please subscribe and over to the right, hit the all bell notification and please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It helps the algorithm push me out to more viewers. Thank you and have an awesome day.